I'm trending. My shirt, my belt, my shoes, this shit come from Fendi. These rats can't fit in my chain, cause I'm rocking skinnies. I walk in the room full of bosses, and you know I'm blending. She say I'm a hood nigga with no sense, but bitch, I got plenty. I put them Malaysian up in the head, told her to take out that Remy. I'ma count money till I'm dead, Lord forgive me for sending. I try to be cool, you gon' make the news. I don't know why niggas envy. Forever talk about me, one of the greatest, so you know I'm true. All shit, all shit. And I think time if you don't fucking drink the beer beforehand. It just, it just feels like that little time. It's already, what, 1240? Line so long as fuck. We did a little steer kind of hack. Yeah. Been on a lot of carts. They didn't say anything about skateboards, so might as well put this shit on a skateboard call it a day. This is one of the bigger events that we, we actually have done. And like Caesar said, we did the one in 2022 in SF. And then he also did one, I want to say last year. And his turnout was amazing. It was immaculate. It was about $10,000 if not more, that he did by himself. But yeah, check out the line, guys. What's up, Ben? What are you selling today? Okay, what size is that going to be? It's going to be a 10? Oh, you got so you bought some heat today. Okay, you got the lobsters? Hell yeah, nice, man. I'm sure you got some good-ass offers on them. I hope so. Let's see what he's rocking today. Uh, big red boots on. Uh, these are actually I <laughs> fucked around with them and I trimmed them down. If you guys, like, big cans, you have a charm, so I had to cut them down. Hey man, look, with look, 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 are your feet cooking up in those right now? Actually, no. They're pretty comfortable. Um, hopefully, I'm going to see how I last all day. If not, I have other shoes I could probably fucking swap around and shit. So. Well, the good thing, they look comfortable, man. That's what's up. Hey, man, I got a quick question for you, though. What shoe are you rocking this summer? Oh, your boys hit you up. It's, it's Modelo time. What, what are you throwing on? I'm going to be honest with you. I want to say the Yeezy Foam Runners. It's a classic. You can wear it with anything. Comfortable. You can be with them all day. Yep. Yo, if you watch the videos, I rock Foam Runners 24-7. Today, I didn't. But he ain't lying, man. I'm throwing them. I'm throwing them bitches on too. Want me to run? <laughs> All right. We're running, I guess. I didn't bring my nine piece today, so I could run freely today. Hey, what a slave, man! Got to carry them boxes. Got to hustle them anyway, right? That's what I'm talking about. So what we're gonna do right now is gonna ask people for twenty dollars. Can you name this specific shoe right here? And uh, we'll put it down what it's called. And I didn't have a twenty, so it's all five. So. Isaiah, would you get this question or no? You're out, you're shot. Why should you be like the first person? All right, for $20, what shoe is this? Oh, it's the Jordan 5 Wings. Oh my God. I know this. Take it. Oh, it works, okay. What? On the spot, the Jordan 5 one. Wings. We, I told, what I, I, I even said it. I, can't, I, I came to the wrong person. I thought we were gonna go a couple. Oh, really? What size are you, bro? I got them, I swear. Let me go get them. I'll be right back. I mean, uh, so we just asked you a question of what the, the Jordan 5s were. Yeah. And it so happened to be that you were the first person and you actually got the answer right. And what else? <laughs> and, and what size are you? 13. And we got them. We got them for you. That's going to be so crazy right now. Size 13. Look at that. You can't make this up, man. These are nutty. So I'm asking 450, but throw me an offer. Shout out to six year official. So talk about the drip, what you got on? I got hat red ones, All right. and then my friend had custom Air Force ones. Let's see those custom. Customs by you? Yeah. I just walk in with the Taliban. Hey, I just walk in with the Taliban. Hey, what's up, guys? So we just met up with some guy who just owns a sneaker store. So we're doing that cash out right now. We're about to get it going with Abel, and then we're gonna do it with Eric as well with Cheech Kicks. Coming from uh, Austin, Texas, uh, we're, we uh, we usually try to come out to a few uh, sneaker events. You know, we're, we're pretty passionate about uh, sneakers and meeting people and traveling, and at the same time, I mean, uh, you know, 
get some deals and uh, try to make some money. You know yeah, I mean? man. What actually got you started with uh, sneakers? Uh, for me, it was always a passion. I mean, growing up, I mean, just uh, rocking sneakers, Jordans, Nikes, stuff like that. Always, you know, take them off, clean them up uh, right before I put them in my box. You know, that way I can keep them safe and be ready for the next wear. Um, I would try to just get a, a, a retail pair, two retail pairs, sell one for double, and then try to you know keep one for free. Five years ago, six years ago, it was about like the the off white. Um, the 10, which has kind of started all for, for pretty much everybody. And from there, I mean, you just you saw some sneakers that had some value and um, just another way of income as, uh, as well. So, most definitely, most yeah, definitely. Yeah, it's definitely. kind of like a passive income for him. And then I know for myself, that was one of the big factors that yep. got me into the space. Um, as well as Caesar. Caesar was the one that started it all for us. But yeah, man, I mean, what kind of Jordan would you say is like your market right now? Like for us, so to say, it's kind of more dunks where we rely on because I know those, those fives or 12s or like those random Retros don't really push for us as yeah, much as we would like. It's just kind of crazy, man. Like the, the like back in the day, like five, six, and seven. Guys, I'm the score shoes kicks here. What's up? So I got started in sneakers about 2002. Uh, just started collecting. Uh, I was a skater, you know, just wanted to go out and buy shoes. Uh, and then when I got older, I could afford a little bit more, so I started buying more shoes and just kind of, kind of kept growing from there. Hell yeah, man! I mean, your collection is fucking insane. I mean, I'm looking at your stand right now, and it's pretty like exclusive, and it's pretty, yeah, pretty wide variety. I know he was talking about that you had the sizes a little bit bigger, about 12, 13, yeah. right? Is yeah, that kind of like your market that you strive for? No, really. It's just like that's what I wear, you know. So like, I just a lot of the shoes I bought were just in, uh, I guess collected were just my size and stuff. But since I got partnered with SneakerCon, I just started carrying other sizes uh, and started helping out the other small free people out there in the world. Yeah, yeah this is uh, Chicago day one. We'll be here day two. If we're not in your city this time, we'll, we'll definitely try to meet you in the, the next city. I know you got a lot of customers coming up to you, but one last question for you, man. What is like your most favorite sneaker? Like if your house is burning down right now, what are you running for inside the house to go grab and save? You gotta save one sneaker. Just one sneaker. One sneaker. One sneaker. It can only be one. If I had a guess, it'd probably be that CPM for him. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm okay. Sure, That's his guess for you. What would you say? Uh, for me, no, it's reverse skunk. It's oh, one of my one of my favorite all time shoes. The reverse skunk. It's one of my all time favorite shoes. One of four twenty. It's just and for me, it's just personal. Hell yeah. But I, I really love that shoe. I, it, but it's hard. I hope they're not hearing me talk bad about you. I love you all. I promise. <laughs> that we're about to sell. We got some Shadow One, some Midnight, some Yeezy, two Yeezys that we're selling, the Yeezy Light and a Yeezy Natural and then the Military Black Test 8.5. I got 1505 on my end. You can do the math on your end. We got a good sale going on. Man, Abel, all the way out from Texas, guys. All the way out from Texas. It's crazy. We're out here. We're definitely going to try to slide out to SneakerCon in Texas. Just catch us out in Texas. <laughs> I'll probably have to go back to the table. For real, tell us that. be like, nah, you got the wrong one. Like, I got a better deal anyway. There you go. See, so you shop with 6 year old sneaks, you get the best deal. Give us a rundown real quick, Caesar. How many pairs of shoes did he just get right now? He ended up getting seven pairs. You know, pretty good deal for on his end. And, you know, even better deal on our end. How do you Seriously, expect to sell shit you if you ain't even marketing it, baby? This is the last pair? This is the last pair? Last one, man. Everything so far so good. Left shoe, right shoe, same size. It's kind of what you want to look for, so. I definitely recommend if you're buying anything. Definitely check both shoes. Check the quality on it if it's right for you. Always. Everything, everything looks good. It's good. We're at 1505. 1505. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, and five. five. Count it again, brother. All right, then, brother. Appreciate Thanks you, man. So, man. Appreciate yeah. it. Nice meeting you again, brother. Hey. What do you got on today? Uh, Central. Okay. What Central. Else? What else? Uh, foam. Foam. Easy so. Okay. Oh, what else? What else? What you got on? Um, uh, undergold. And uh, Yeah, okay. Sheesh, you out here tripping. Where are you? Where are you? Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico. Oh, Boricua, baby. Bad buddy, bad buddy. Drag him on hand. Dude, show him the door. Show him the door. Show him the door. The door is right fucking there. That's the fucking entrance, right? Literally the entrance, and we still got so much more to go. What do you do? How much are you asking for that? We're asking 150. They found the kid, they found the kid. There was a missing kid and they found him. They just announced it. Congratulations. This is a size seven. You said you're a seven and a half? I got you. Let me look for it real quick. Are you interested in it? How much are you looking for? 150? I told her 150. Well, we'll do 140 for you guys, yeah, that's most definitely. Yeah, we'll do it definitely. How many are we doing? 300. It's because we're in Chicago, huh? Good drip right here. With me in the wave, but in the morning. Do you still want me? Can I be honest? I still want your hands up on my body. You still make my heart beat fast. Ferrari with me in the wave, but in the morning. Do you still want me?
Last minute, last minute, he came out. He pulled up. And so they got money to spend. Like to act tough, she like to tone them off and make them straighten up their hat cause she know they soft. And when I grew up, she showed me how to go downtown. And at nighttime, my face lit up. 